To better navigate through the files, it's useful to show thumbnails of the STL files in the file view rather than a generic file icon. My name is Peter and this is a short tip on how to get STL file thumbnails in the file manager and what file viewer I use for STL files. Although I use Linux, this is applicable to other platforms as the software is available for them as well. There is a STL thumb project on GitHub by Tyler Anderson that does this for Linux and Windows. The URL of the project is given in the description. When you go to the releases, you can download the installation file for your platform. There is an exe file for Windows and JEP packages for Linux distributions. And now I will demonstrate the installation on my Ubuntu. The download of the dev package is now complete and the installation can begin. In my case I do this in the terminal, navigate to the folder where the installation package is and run the installation via apt install. The installation must be done with elevated privileges so it must be run with sudo. Once the installation is complete you should see previews in the file manager. If you use KDE you should also install the STL thumb KDE package. When thumbnails of the STL files are now displayed it would be useful if the STL files were associated with a quick viewer so that I double click opens the viewer and I can view the object. Meshlab can be used for this purpose. The URL of the project is also in the description. It is available for all major platforms for free and for Ubuntu is also available through the software manager. So I will install it through the Ubuntu software manager. After installation in Ubuntu, Meshlab may not be listed among the applications that can be associated with the STL files. Then you need to change the command to execute in the desktop file for Meshlab. You must do this with elevated privileges. Open the meshlab.desktop file and add percent %f to the end of the execute command. After saving, Meshlab should appear in a dialog where you can choose which application is associated with the STL files. If everything went well, double click on the STL file should open the viewer. If you find this tip useful, give it a like, subscribe and I will be happy to hear from you in the comments.